G'day guys, Chris Eves here, your personal trainer, and it's Wednesday, I'm back, another edition of V News. So what's going on this week? Well, it's the weather's warming up and so is the calendar. Got a few things to talk about, so I'll get straight into it. Uh, firstly, I neglected to announce the winner of the t-shirt from the t-shirt competition during the week. So stay tuned, I'll stick a little video of the draw on the Facebook this afternoon, and I might even um, spill my guts a bit early at the session a bit later on and announce the winner. Um, next thing, big weekend coming up. It's the uh, Adelaide Running Festival, the Adelaide Marathon. We've got Glenn and Linda, uh, sorry, Glenn and Sandra. Didn't mean to take your credit away there, Sandra. Didn't mean to give you a heart attack, Linda. <laughs> Doing the Adelaide Half Marathon this weekend. So that starts at 8 in the city and uh, runs all around the city. Best vantage point, I reckon, from about 9am would be where, the, where King William Road crosses the river just near the Adelaide Oval there. Um, I'll be going in there after the um, City to Bay training, looking to see them both finish or maybe give them a high five on their last um, last few kilometres as they run past a couple of times because they run through that area uh, twice. So if you're keen to come along, happy to give anyone a lift from the City to Bay training. You can squeeze in the back of the van there somewhere or get along there yourself. Be great uh, if someone can get in there to see them start. And if a group of us can get in there to see them finish, wishing you both all the best for Sunday. Our next City to Bay training is underway. It started last Sunday. It was a nice little group and perfect conditions for our first training run. The event itself is on Sunday, 18th of September. And again, it'd be great for everyone to show their support to the people that are getting involved in that event. So line the streets of Jetty Road as the finish. Sip on your coffee as we come, uh, come down the finish shoot there. Uh, next, just a quick reminder, not this coming Friday, but the following Friday is our next Lime and Soda Fridays. For the new people among you that don't know what that is, it's really just an excuse for a social chit chat. We'll have that at the Brighton Surf Life Saving Club starting from about 5.30, so a bit of a sundowner on a Friday afternoon. And if you let them know that you're training with me, you get a free Lime and Soda. How cool is that? You have to put your own um, whatever other mixes you're going to put in there. Bitters, for example. Um, uh, next one on the agenda, last one for the week, is uh, True Grit Night Attack. Time to start thinking about that, whether you want to train for that or think about your registration. That's on uh, Thursday night, the 29th of September. Collins registered himself already, created us a team, so if you want to join the team, it's hashtag CEPT is the team that you select when you're joining. That's about all I've got for this week. It's um, yeah, great week to get outdoors. It's um, not looking so bad out there. It looks a little bit grey if you look over that way, but uh, it's going past us, so I'm supposed to be a uh, chance to get outside and, and catch some fresh air. It's supposed to be getting a bit wet later on, so do that this morning. Go for a walk at morning tea time. Get out of your office chair um, wherever you're at. Alright, that's all for this week. What have we got? That's uh, 2 minutes 49 seconds. Let's see if we can talk for 11 more seconds. That shouldn't be hard knowing me. Anyway, that's all for now. Catch you next week. Have a great one. See ya.